Overcoming mistakes is a huge thing in baseball. They call it the game of failure. Hall of Famers will get out seven times out of ten. You know, the stats speak for themselves, but what you can do as a player and what works for me is when you make a mistake, which isn't inevitably going to happen physically, um, take a big deep breath. For me, that really works. Um, you know, coming up through the system, you know, I made a lot of mistakes, but, you know, seeing the big picture really helps also. Um, understanding that baseball is a long season, it's a hard game, you're going to have uh, failures. Just knowing that gives you the confidence to be able to, to bounce back because it's going to happen and there's nothing you can do about it. Well, there are differences between failures mentally and physically. Physically, uh, you're going to have errors just because we're humans and you know it's, it's hard to repeat these motions over and over, but mentally is the ones you want to avoid. And that comes from your preparation and your attitude, and those are things you can 100% control. Um, so mental errors are a little bit different, and sometimes you might need to rely on a teammate to help you snap out of that mental, or a coach snap out of that mental mistake. But all in all, you want to avoid those mental mistakes by preparing and you know concentrating on the task at hand.